Ugh, sorry. Thank you, Ryan. Wow. I'm going to be taking you to an exciting event today, um, and that is the APP, the annual Australian Pharmacy Professional Conference. Um, it's held once a year, and, you, and it's usually at a really, really big venue, and it's at the Gold Coast Exhibition Centre. So we're going to be driving there. Um, I have a friend coming along as well. It's going to be a really great day. So what's the APP? So it's basically a huge conference and networking event. The APP um, spans over four days, um, usually from Thursday to Sunday. Today is a Sunday. I'm only attending the free event, uh, which is the trade exhibition event, the one that everyone goes to and goes nuts. I'm there to collect lots of freebies and meet a lot of industry industry suppliers, talk with them, you get to see the latest product innovation, like innovation products and product developments. So that's that. You have to like make sure you look at the lens. Yeah. Hello. We're at APP Conference 2022. We just got our name badge, uh, which says where we're from, which pharmacy. So Vicky works at... So I work for Queensland Health, I'm a pharmacist. Um, I work at this poison information centre, so I deal with um, acute poisonings and overdoses and that sort of thing. Yep. Um, yeah, I'm also a med student, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Really, really interesting because I don't know many people working at the health and poisons. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like a really specialist job. Very, you yeah. need to do a lot of training um, yeah. when you start, but it's a really interesting job and I really, really enjoy it. That's really good. And then, as you guys know, I am a rotational pharmacist, which you can see, and I'm everywhere. So. I'm sick of daydreaming. I just want the feeling of you in my bed. I'm down at this waistline, right below your waistline. Want you by my head. I'm doing all this face time, need some alone time, baby You're always running in my mind I'm sick of daydreaming, I just want the feeling of you in my bed So 
honestly, this product works. So, you know, sometimes when men are on the medications that are in large prostate, they're still getting up to go to the toilet a lot at night and feeling like they're never empty. Yeah. <laughs> Junctions with the stomach will kind of help with the psychology suction. Yeah, it's so exciting. It's very fluky and very good. And the bravo. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, we help the gut junction. Gut, yeah, the gut junction. Oh no. <laughs> I just come in, come in, come in. Jess is my fellow colleague, <laughs> friend, and pharmacist. What do you want? Oh, it's like this can yeah. yeah. Supplies and what else? Um, pharmaceutical companies like I, I know, like Sanofi and GSK. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All the other ones. Yeah. The point of this um, is you can get a bit of education, talk to the you know, representatives and professionals. Um, yeah, get educated about the products. You see the new products that are coming out that aren't even in pharmacies yet. Yeah, um, I think yeah. So that's the good part. Like you can actually see what's all the new stuff. So. I hope yeah. you guys enjoy this video. All the free stuff. <laughs> all this. <laughs> Look at all. Oh, that's my stuff. Okay, it's all compressed. Yeah. What's the um most excited thing you're wanting to try? Um, the eye drops because I have dry eyes. <laughs> which one? Which eye drop? Um, Show us. I actually want to find that new one. You want to talk about this one? Oh yeah, that one. I also want to try the that one as well. The sustain, which has got, it's got hyaluronic acid in it and something else. But oh, it's got like a bunch of stuff like sodium hyaluronate, polyethylene glycol, and a bunch of. And stuff. what is hyaluronic acid good for? It's retaining the moisture. No, that's okay. Yeah. Well, didn't the lady say it's good at retaining the moisture? Like, or? like, when you put it into your eyes, it helps retain moisture in your eyes. Yeah. Like, it's also used in skincare. So, yeah. like, you have, like, high use, hyaluronic serums and all that, which you can put in your face, and it pretty much yeah. helps your face retain moisture. So, it does the same thing in your yeah. eyes. Yeah. Thank and you. Yeah. I use Hylophort, which also has that. Yeah. everything on the table there's so much stuff as you can see I'm trying to go through some main products we got so um, starting from here let's go so we've got lots of sustained products this is one of the newest ones hydration UD I use sustain complete a lot myself we've got some blackmores bio this is a vitamin C powder um, we've got some mask lid wipes what is this? We've got some samples from La Roche Posay, the French brand. Uh, got a little sorbling cream, some some writing notebook. Ultra when you saw me spraying this earlier. Um, loads of vitamin K2 and D3 from Caruso's, and the pain analgesic for joints. We've got like packets and packets. We're never gonna finish this. And as you can see, we've got lots of coffee cups. I don't even know if I'm gonna use it. Centrum Energizing Girl will probably really need this one. 
Um, lots of maxagesic, honestly. But I do get frequent headaches, so this will be really good for me. Some dental floss stuff, random dinosaur. Oh, this is um, bisolvin duo syrup. So for those of you who, um, this works for both dry cough and chesty cough from what I know. Um, and I think it's marshmallow extract, which I actually don't really like the taste of it. I had it I've had it before, it worked well, but I hate the taste of it. And then we've got lots of Dimatap Kids 2 Plus Open. Not that there's any like kids in our household at all. Um, then lots of Sinova stuff. Oh my gosh, enough vitamins for like five years. Ostelin, Bone. This is a really interesting product. I genuinely quite like Life Space myself. I take their probiotics very often. The first um, pro probiotic that's been made for skin from them. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty excited to try this out. Look at all the, all those ingredients. Yeah, so all these different strains. Um, okay, so then we've got some glucogel bears. What else have we got? Oh, we just ran out of body wash, so this will be great to try. Same goes for face wash as well. Some more sustain products, lots of pens, some face masks. Um, uh, gym towels, which will be super useful because we like some free gym towels. I'm all washed up and I'm really tired, but this marks the end of my video and I hope you guys had lots of fun with me today. Thanks for joining me um, and I hope you gained a little bit of insight into you know, what sort of events like pharmacists or people who work in pharmacy attend. Anyone can come to the trade exhibition for free. You just have to sign up on the ABP um, website and it's held in the Gold Coast Exhibition Centre. Well, every year as from what I know. Now, only the trade exhibition is free if you want to attend the other three or four day sort of events, which includes, I've got my computer here, so it includes kind of like your, um, your entry to conference sessions, your morning and afternoon teas, I suppose it's more like networking stuff, uh, welcome reception and the ABP street party then it does cost a fair bit. It ranges from a couple hundred dollars to like a thousand dollars, depending on what sort of events um, that you want to attend in those four days. But just remember, if you're a guild member or if you're a pharmacy assistant, pharmacy student, um, and early career pharmacist, then you definitely get a discount on all these events. And if you are a guild intern, you definitely should take advantage of this because this is the only year where everything will be free for you. So you, you should go, bring a friend, grab somebody and, you know, get them to come along with you. You'll have lots of fun, trust me. So if you liked this video today, you liked me showing you a sneak peek tour um, for the APP event and just in general, just like me showing you pharmacy stuff, then please give it a like, thumbs up and subscribe. It would really, really help out my channel and I really, really appreciate each one of you. Um, yes. I'm so bad at talking to the camera. I, my brain just freezes up. But thank you so much again. That's all I have to say. Uh, thanks for joining me on this. And I'll see you guys on the next one.